Well, since we had left me on board, I suppose we grow 120 members. The base of about 11 months. So before, I think we were running about between 13 and 15,000 a month. Now we're consistently hitting around 50 per month. Yeah, that's total revenue, yeah. Name is Dean. I'm the owner here of Embassy Gym in Carrot McCross. And um, that's where we are, Carrot McCross, County Mon in Ireland. The facility itself is 5,000 square foot. Members wise, we probably have about 300 in the open gym on average, because uh, up and down month by month. In the PT, we're actually about 120 now of, of members. We're only open just less than a year, so quite happy with that. And then we've got 35 trialists who will eventually, obviously, hopefully become members. So we're a one to six model. Um, large group then one to 24, two to 24, depending on the session. And we have three coaches running three pods. For our open gyms, 55 euro per month. And then for our personal training, front end is about 347. And then on the back end, it depends on obviously the, the package the guys go with, on average about 247 per month. We have four coaches, we have one head of sales, and we have one head of facilities, and we also have an admin. Uh, prior to FMA, done a lot of guessing. <laughs> it was organic marketing, Instagram, Facebook, the usual. Dabbled in a little bit of paid, but never really fully understood it. A lot of it was word of mouth because we are the only gym locally, but we wanted to really kick things up a notch and get in when that's what we obviously got with you guys and got so, with our first campaign, it was gym launch. We got about 270 leads in space for two weeks. We started probably with about 40 something trialists out of that. And obviously we still actually get people from that league campaign now when I revisit it. But it was amazing to open on day one with 40 something trailers off the bat. It was a good feeling. I obviously was never used to lead volume like that. I guess it takes the guesswork out of it for us, especially we you know what our demographic is. And you guys have so many different campaigns that slot into that. Like for us, the beginners campaign, the plus 45s was amazing. We know that we can probably turn that on anytime we want. And it guarantees a good steady lead flow that we are confident that we can back up and convert. So. Uh, Predictability, knowing obviously now we can actually set like confident targets of lead flow per month, conversion per month, sales per month, all of that through I guess understanding demographic better and just knowing that the campaigns will work. So yeah, masterminds are amazing. Um, I was at the one in the Viva there in April. It was fantastic. I think just being in an environment of like many individuals who are going down the same journey, sharing opinions. I actually got talking to a lot of people now that I still kind of reference and, and, and have conversations with when I'm stuck in things, just through kind of mixing at the events. So I think besides the event itself, the networking opportunities were massive for me. So if you're skeptical or on the fence with joining FMA, it's 100% worth it. All these different things, it's, whether it's mentorship, investment, and in marketing agency, whatever it is, it does come at a price. But it's designed that there's going to be return on investment and if you if you're willing to commit and learn how to sell and learn how to follow up with people and be confident in what you're doing with it it's just going to pay for itself anyway so 100 it's been more than a game changer for what we do here yeah